People have unearthed treasures and valuable items in uninhabited places throughout history. From ancient tombs to artworks and precious coins, the discovery of such artifacts has become an increasingly popular activity among adventurers and treasure hunters. Despite the risks, the allure of finding something valuable drives many people to undertake this adventure. Today, we will explore 10 discoveries of ancient objects. Number 10. Sports cards in an old building in Detroit. In downtown Detroit, inside an old building used for Cadillac vehicle molds, a group of urban explorers made a surprising discovery, a vast collection of sports cards. Initially, these cards were considered a treasure, symbolizing the passion of a sports enthusiast who had devoted his life to following athletes and teams of his time. However, the excitement was soon overshadowed by disappointment when it emerged that much of the collection consisted of minor league hockey cards from the 1990s, lacking significant value. It was learned that these cards had been abandoned by a man named Hub Hemmins, who had forgotten about them over the years until his passing. Number 9. Nicolas Cage Comic Book Nicolas Cage experienced a moment of great distress when his precious copy of Action Comics No. 1, valued at over a million dollars, was stolen from his home. This event represented a devastating loss for Cage, not only in economic terms but also emotionally, given the symbolic and sentimental value attached to that comic book. However, in 2010, Fortune decided to smile upon the actor when, after years of searching and hoping, the same copy was randomly found inside an abandoned safe deposit box in Tennessee. This unexpected discovery certainly brought some joy and relief after such a painful loss, demonstrating that sometimes fate can hold positive surprises even in the darkest times. Number 8. Charlotte Bronte's Gold Ring A small gold ring with a fragment of hair believed to have belonged to the writer Charlotte Bronte was found in an attic in Scotland in 2021. The ring, inherited from the family of Arthur Bell Nichols, Bronte's husband, had remained hidden for many years. This discovery sparked great interest in the literary world, reigniting curiosity about Bronte's life and work. Although she is one of the most celebrated authors in English literature, Bronte remains a mysterious figure, having lived a short life and left few personal writings. The discovery of the ring, secretly kept for so long, fuels speculation about why it was hidden and what it might reveal about Bronte's private life. During the 19th century, it was common to keep the hair of deceased loved ones as a memento. Today, fortunately, we have photos and videos to remember our loved ones. For Bronte fans, the ring represents a tangible connection to the beloved author. In any case, this discovery underscores the power of literature to carry stories and characters through time. Number 7. Thornbury Hoard The discovery of the Thornbury Hoard represents an event of extraordinary significance in archaeology, consisting of a vast collection of Anglo-Saxon silver coins found in Thornbury, South Gloucester, in 2021 by a metal-detecting enthusiast named Ken Allen. This archaeological treasure, dating back to the early 11th century during the reign of Gallianus and the Constantinian dynasty in England, has captured the attention of experts for its exceptional scope, counting over 11,000 individual coins of various denominations. The discovery took place in 2004 when Ken Allen was digging a pond in his garden and unexpectedly unearthed the treasure buried in the ground for almost a millennium. The coins of the Thornbury Hoard, all made of silver, bear on one side the effigy of monarchs and other royal figures, while on the other, they are decorated with a variety of religious symbols. Surprisingly, despite the long burial period, the coins were found in an extraordinary state of preservation. Number 6. Ancient Maya Artifacts Nick DeMola, a janitor in Queens, made a surprising discovery when he took a mysterious barrel from an apartment in Soho. Inside the barrel were ancient Mexican artifacts, including Maya objects worth $16,000. 
These objects had been left behind by an abstract artist, Clinton Hill, to his partner, Alan Tran, and Demola was tasked with clearing the space. After years of neglect in a warehouse, Demola opened the barrel and made an incredible discovery. Although the foundation formed by Hill's friends to retrieve valuable items from the studio could not reclaim the items from Demola, he planned to sell them despite not personally appreciating ancient art. This tells the story of the saying, one man's trash is another man's treasure. Number five, the waiting cat. In the world of exploration, sometimes it's in the most unexpected discoveries that the greatest fascination lies. That's exactly what happened to an explorer who stumbled upon an abandoned house in the middle of nowhere. At first, it seemed just like another deserted building left to decay in the wilderness. However, as soon as he crossed the threshold, he sensed something different in the air, an atmosphere thick with neglect and decay, hinting that no one had been there for a long time. Slowly, as he explored the deserted rooms, he reached the bedroom, and it was there that he made the most surprising discovery. A small cat lay motionless on the owner's bed, with its eyes still open as if awaiting the return of its master. It was a heart-wrenching moment, as it seemed that the cat belonged to the owner of the house and that its death was due to the lack of someone to take care of it. This sight evoked a mix of emotions in the explorer. On one hand, sadness for the fate of the abandoned cat, and on the other, a sense of wonder at the animal's loyalty and silent waiting. Number 4. Mummified Child in May 2016, during construction work in a house in San Francisco, a surprising discovery was made. The mummified remains of a child, dating back approximately 145 years. This event sparked a mystery that fascinated the city and generated great public interest. It all began when the new owners of the house hired a contractor for renovation work. During these works, a small coffin containing the body of the child estimated to have died at the age of three was found. This discovery caused a great shock and prompted the new owners to immediately contact the authorities. The matter was then entrusted to the San Francisco Medical Examiner's Office, which launched an investigation to identify the child and clarify the circumstances of their death. It wasn't until 2018, after years of research and DNA testing, that the child was finally identified as Edith Howard Cook, born in 1873 to a prominent family in San Francisco. Number three, crime treasure. In 1993, after the death of Pablo Escobar during a shootout with the police, a raid on his luxurious residence in Madeline, Colombia, revealed an incredible treasure. Millions of dollars in cash hidden among walls, ceilings, and underground safes. This discovery fueled huge speculation about Escobar's criminal activities and how he managed to accumulate such wealth. It emerged that Escobar was the head of the infamous Medellin cartel, involved in drug trafficking, money laundering, and other crimes. It is presumed that the money found in his residence was only a small part of his vast fortune. The Colombian government seized the money and earmarked the funds for social projects but the management of such funds sparked controversies and accusations of corruption. Despite efforts to use the money for public good, the discovery only strengthened Escobar's legend as a criminal genius and led to speculation about other possible hidden treasures linked to his criminal empire. Number two, movie posters. Two builders stumbled upon a collection of 66 movie posters dating back to the 1930s and 1940s during renovation work on a relative's house who owned a cinema in Cardiff. These posters, used as insulation under the carpet, remained surprisingly well-preserved despite the long period spent under the floor. The films promoted by the posters boasted the presence of Hollywood celebrities such as Laurence Olivier, Boris Karloff, Vivian Lee, and John Wayne. Among the most prized posters at auction was that of John Ford's classic 1939 Western Stagecoach, which sold for £37,200. 
horror movie posters garnered significant interest, with one from the 1940 film Black Friday, starring Boris Karloff and Bela Lugosi, reaching a price of £1,240. Number one, original painting by Giovanni Boldini. There is a unique charm in places that have preserved traces of people's past. Such is the case with an apartment in Paris, which remained closed for 70 years after the owner left to escape a Nazi attack in 1942. Surprisingly, he continued to pay rent until his death at the age of 91. The apartment belonged to the granddaughter of Marta de Florian, a well-known actress and socialite. After years of abandonment in 2021, a group explored the place, discovering a true treasure, an apartment frozen in time with an extraordinary painting of Marta de Florian by Giovanni Boldini. This painting, dating back to 1898, reveals not only the beauty of art, but also a love story between the artist and the model. This discovery was valued incredibly at $3.4 million and considered one of the greatest artistic wonders of the century. Our journey has come to an end for today, but it won't be the last. Don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed the video. See you in the next adventure.